Hey everyone, I'm back with another video, but this one is gonna be slightly different. So I don't know about you guys, but I am obsessed with Amazon. I have been a prime member of Amazon for a few years already, but I've never really purchased any clothing from there until today. So in this video, we're going to be doing a try on haul, and I really want to see if the dresses look the same in person as they do online in the photos on Amazon, because the photos look so cute, the models look so cute wearing the clothing. So I purchased a few dresses, we're gonna try them on and see how they look. I have a couple of weddings that I'm going to towards the end of the year in the next couple of months or so and I mainly bought I bought a couple of casual dresses because they looked super cute but then I bought others that are more on the formal wedding promish type of vibe dress I don't know I don't even know if they're my size I so I just listen we're gonna try them on we're gonna see how they look we're gonna see if they look the same as a photo I got all of my packages in yesterday I haven't even opened them up, so we're gonna open them up together. So we are going to open them up together and see how they look. So in no particular order, I'm gonna go ahead and open them up. I'm gonna tell you guys the price, the description online, show you guys the picture online, and then we're gonna try them on and see the comparison. So let's go ahead and get started. It's about to pour, so I wanna get this video up before it starts raining because then it's gonna get gloomy and we're gonna have no lighting. <sighs> Here we go. Here we are. Okay, I moved a little bit further away from the window because I was getting really hot. And I'm using natural lighting, so if the light goes in and out, that's why. So I got one, ow. <laughs> I got one, two, three, four, five, six dresses. Four of them are formal-ish, I guess, more wedding vibes. And two of them are more on the casual side. I just picked these two casual ones because they looked really cute online. So, I don't know which ones I wanna try on first. Let's do casual to formal, okay? So let's start off with this one right here. So this first dress that I'm going to try on retailed for $29.96 and it is called the Women's Vintage Patchwork Pockets Puffy Swing Casual Party Dress. <laughs> OX165 and it has awesome reviews. I mean, first impressions, I really like it. I like the material. It doesn't feel cheap. Let's try it on. First thought and impressions, I really do like this dress. I really like the fabric and the way it feels and the way it looks. It's a really soft, comfortable material. It is not too tight. I think this one for sure is a winner. I think it looks just like the photos online. I really like the way it feels. It is really comfortable. I could definitely see myself wearing this kind of all day pretty much. It's very flowy. I love the pops of color and the prints along with the dark top. I think it goes really well together. This one is definitely a two thumbs up. I like it. Let's go ahead and try on the next one. This second dress is very similar to where the top is black and then it has a floral bottom, but the skirt on this one goes all the way down to the floor. This one retailed for $29.90, and this one is called the Women's Sexy Two-Piece Floral Print Pockets Long Party Skirts Dress. So as you can see, this is one, and then you just tuck it in. And then the dress is another one. This is definitely one that I would wear with Spanx just to make sure my belly is nice and flat and <gasps> sucked in. But yeah, I mean, it's not bad. I just prefer the first one. I do love that it has pockets. I think that is awesome. I do like it. I just wish the material was a little different. It just feels hot. I think that's the only reason I'm aiming towards the first one better, but it is a beautiful skirt. It's a really nice outfit. I really like it. This video would be a lot easier to film if I had somebody else filming <laughs> so that they could get the whole outfit. So I'm sorry about that. But this one is definitely a different material. The first dress was a one piece. This is a two piece. The shirt and the skirt are completely separate. The first one, I like the material on that one better. The first one's more of a cotton material. It's really soft, very comfortable. This one is more of a satin when it comes to the top and the skirt is a satin material. So it doesn't feel as soft. It's not uncomfortable, but the first one is a lot more comfortable. I do like the skirt on this one as well, but I think I'm aiming more towards 
dress number one. But this one is also really, really pretty. And I do think that this one is also a good representation of the picture that they have online. It's the same thing. So, so far, thumbs up on this one. We have two thumbs up. Now let's go ahead and move on to the formals. Now this dress was a little bit more pricey than the other two. This one retailed for $49.99 and this one is called the Woman's Elegant Sleeveless Floor Length Ruffles Chiffron Bridesmaid Dress. So this is technically a bridesmaid's dress, I guess, but you can wear this as a guest. So this is dress number three. This is the first more formal type of dress and I actually really like it. I didn't think I was going to like it as much as I was taking it out of the bag. Obviously, it's really wrinkled, so ignore that. This one is a long dress. It's a lilac color, kind of like a light purple color. It goes all the way down to the floor and it has these layers. It has four layers total. And it also has like these um, shoulder, what do you call these? Off the shoulder little situation. But I think it's really pretty. I really do like it. I think I would wear this as an everyday dress if it was like up to the knee kind of like as a summer dress it's really really cute i actually really like this one and i do like the material the fabric is very soft and lightweight so it doesn't feel too heavy i don't feel hot in it like i did in the other dress and this one is also long but it feels nice and airy you know what i'm talking about so so yeah this one's really cute. I think this would definitely be like a really cute dress for a wedding. Like something like a summer wedding. I think this is really perfect. So I would also give this one a two thumbs up. I do think it looks just like the photos online. The color is spot on. It's really pretty. I really do like it. This next dress retailed for $28.69. I got it in a blush color, which is the color that I was looking for for all of the dresses. It does come with a really pretty ribbon. This one also has really awesome reviews and it is called the Woman's Floral Lace Dress. Short bridesmaid dresses with sheer neckline. So this is what this one looks like from afar. It's a really pretty lacy dress. It hits up to the knee and I paired it with some nude pumps. Out of all of the dresses, I definitely feel the most comfortable in this one. I would definitely say that this one is also a spot on representation from the photo on Amazon. It looks just like the picture. I really do like this dress, but so far this is the one that I like the most. It is the most comfortable. I love dresses that stop at the knee. I think it looks really cute. I think it's perfect for like a summer wedding as well, or even just an everyday cute little summer dress. I think it's super cute. I love the color. This is the color that I was searching for, but I didn't find too many dresses that were like a blush pink. They were all like, bright pink, neon pink, or lilac. So this was one of the few that I found in that perfect color that I wanted. I think this color looks awesome with the nude pumps. But yeah, so far this is my number one. Okay, this one is not my favorite. I don't, I don't like it. I mean, the dress itself is not bad. I do think that the dress looks like the photos that they have on Amazon. Um, But I'm not really feeling it. I don't know what it is. This one's really heavy. This this is definitely like a um, like a bridesmaid dress. Like the material feels very bridesmaid. Like if you've ever shopped for bridesmaid dresses, you know what I'm talking about. Like that heaviness in a dress. That's how this one feels. It goes all the way down to the floor, which I like. The bottom is really pretty. It has a lace, but you guys can see that it's, it has a really pretty lace. Um, I just don't like how rough it feels like here in the boob area it's a lot of padding like it just feels very stiff and uncomfortable not my favorite dress like by far but it does look exactly like the photos on amazon this one so far has been the most expensive it retailed for 5107 it is also in that really pretty dusty rose color. And this one is called A-Line V-Neck Chiffon Long Empire Bridesmaid Dresses or Simple Prom Dress. This one has four stars, it has nine reviews. So the majority of people really do like this one. Like I mentioned, it's not bad. It's just not really my style. And the top portion feels really uncomfortable. I just, if this wasn't, if, if, if this part didn't feel the way it felt, I think I would really like it. But it's also really heavy. So I'm definitely returning this one. It's not my favorite, but it does look exactly like the photos on Amazon. Oh my God, I feel like I should have done my hair and makeup for this video to like make the dresses look prettier. I didn't even think of that. This dress is by far my favorite. I think it's absolutely beautiful. 
I'm looking kind of rough. But it's really, really pretty. It is lace. I absolutely love lace. This one retailed for $36.99. I picked mine up in a size medium. And this one is called the Woman's Vintage Floral Lace Boat Neck Cocktail Formal Swing Dress. And this one has 2,400 reviews and it has four and a half stars. And I see why. This is by far my favorite dress out of all of them. I think this is the one that I'm going to keep and go with because it's really, really pretty. So this is what it looks like. It looks really pretty, perfect for a wedding occasion. It's a really cute cocktail dress. I also paired it with the same nude pumps. I really think that nude pumps go with everything. I think that every woman should have a pair of nude pumps in her closet because they look good with all dresses. So I paired it with some nude pumps. Of course, the skirt is on the wrinkly side, but once you obviously steam this, it's a really beautiful dress. It has a little side zipper, which is also really easy. You don't need anybody's help with the back zipper. It has one here on the side, which is really convenient. And I really do like the neckline. I think this is my favorite dress. Really great representation. This is what the back side looks like. I love it a lot. So this was the last dress. That's it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. Let me know if you did enjoy it. Let me know which one was your favorite dress. So that's it, you guys. Thanks again for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.